Welcome to ITU Telecom World 2017 here in Busan in the Republic of Korea. I'm very pleased to be in the studio today with the Honorable Sidi M. Tunis, who is a Member of Parliament, Minority Chief Whip for the Republic of uh, Sierra Leone. Thank you very much indeed for being with us in the studio. It's my pleasure. Now I'd like to start off by talking about uh, the theme of this year's uh, ITU Telecom World is Smart Digital Transformation. What does that mean for Sierra Leone? Yeah, for us in Sierra Leone, we, see, we believe that we are still behind. We've missed the first generation, we've missed the second one, third one, this is the fourth generation. For us to be here really is good for us. And I believe that after here, we'll ensure that we are part of the fourth generation. So we will not be left behind. And what are the key smart opportunities that you see in the next five years? And what do you think will be the key challenges for you? For us in Sierra Leone, in the last four years, we have done tremendously well in uh, ensuring that there's serious investment in the, in the ICT sector. We have landed our submarine cable. We have also rolled out our national fiber backbone. We also have uh, now begin to connect schools. So for the next five years, we are actually looking at e-governance, e-education, e-agriculture, e-health. And what about the uh, projects or solutions that you're exhibiting here? What's the role of SMEs in, in uh, driving uh, the digital economy in Sierra Leone? As I said, we have been behind. But like uh, for this particular ITU Telecom World, we have exhibited our fiber optic uh, solutions. We roll, we roll it out and now SMEs are capitalizing on that to open internet cafes, etc., etc. That's great, and yeah. it's going well. It's a, it's uh, yeah, absolutely, absolutely, it's going well, and we are hoping that uh, the connectivity will continue. Now you're basically exhibiting here at Telecom World. What's the value of exhibiting at this event for you, and what are you hoping to achieve, and what have you learned, and what that has proved most exciting? A whole lot. It's a whole lot for me. The five G. Olympic thing I saw with the Koreans is so exciting and I, we also saw something my team uh, my, myself and my delegation we also saw something with the, uh, the team from Rwanda on e-agriculture it's very very exciting and I believe that we have learned a lot and from here there's a whole lot for example even the connectivity itself we have now found out that there are cheaper ways of doing it apart from the microwave we have seen companies, we have interacted with companies, and there are so many ISPs that we have interacted with. And for me, we will we'll transform our society through them. We have invited a whole lot of them to our country, and I believe that they will come over. That's great. And finally, what's your key message for participants at this event? My key message really is to the investors. We need investment in the ICT industry in our country. We have rolled out our fiber optic and we have also met with a lot of investors here. We are hoping that they will come over to us in Sierra Leone and contribute and invest in our, in our country. That way, as you know, the whole idea of ITU Telecom World is networking. We have networked a lot and we are appealing to them to come to Sierra Leone to invest. The atmosphere is there, the laws are there for them, to be, they are all protected. The, 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 the country is very safe for investment. Well, we wish you the very best of the future and thank you very much. For thank you very much. Thank you very much for having me here. Yes.